Hey. It's me. Okay. I'm doing this on um, my camera on my webcam. So, I don't know how it's going to come out. And it looks like it's um, my talking is. Look at this. My mouth is not doing my talking. It's um, taking a second after I uh, talk. So, it's going to look ridiculous. I hope you don't mind. So, um, it's a new day. Uh, yeah, I better look at you. Uh, it's a new day, and things are interesting. Things are good. It's almost cl close to Christmas. And I've had some people send me cards, and I've had them send me patterns, and I've had them uh, send me uh, my snag nabbit. Laura's mad at me. She said, you shouldn't do that. You know? And I've had people on the, uh, the website say, um... You shouldn't do that. No. No. It's like you can't see me. Okay, I'll do this. Um, anyways, she said that um, I shouldn't have put it on the website, and I've had a uh, I've had um, people from my Facebook groups say, oh, I'm having a bad um, uh, uh, Christmas too, and, you know, whoop to do and et cetera, et cetera. And, you know, I'm not going to let that upset me. You know, I wasn't feeling good. I um, needed something that I couldn't pay for, and I was letting people know that, look, I, I'm not doing anything for Christmas because I don't have the finances. And, you know, <sighs> here, you can see my eyes now. Oh, gosh, they look terrible. Anyways, um... If I offended somebody, I apologize. And if I had a book or something to sit on, I would sit on it. Uh, you know, I, I, I can't let others dictate to me what I do and don't do. You know, if you wanted to send me something, yay! Um, if you didn't, no big. You, you know, you guys are always telling me that. If I need something. So, I asked. <laughs> I got a couple of cards. Um, some patterns. A bunch of thread. And, um, I pulled them up uh, individually. But I put them in my stash already. Boo-hoo. I wanted to thank these people. But, uh, and I've got their, their, um, envelopes to tell you who they are, but they didn't send to tell you, and I can't go get the envelopes and, and show you because that's their address. Um, so I couldn't be, shouldn't be a done doing that. But, because they blessed me, God will bless them. And that's what I believe. That through me, he will bless others. And that, um, how do I say this without being arrogant? Um, the Lord says, I will bless those who bless you. And I will curse those who curse you. And since I believe the Bible speaks the truth. And I don't believe it's any respecter of persons, you know, it's 
for those that he speaks to and the Christians who, who have chosen him, not just me, um, then I believe that's true. People will be blessed because you have blessed me. And if you curse me, watch out. Not that anybody curse me. Just be careful if you curse a Christian, you know, because uh, God won't be pleased. Uh, I've been, uh, I keep looking over there, I'm sorry. It's, it's hard for me to look directly at the camera, you know, directly at a person. It, it's, it's really hard. You know, I always look up or look down or look to the side or, you know, it is really, really hard for me to look a person in the eyes. And here I am, I'm talking and my, my screen is filled with my face. Okay, it's my face, but in order to talk and be uh, actually relevant, I have to look myself in the face, in the eyes. I have a problem with that. You know, I don't care if it's just my eyes. It's my own eyes. I have a problem. Uh, actually, the bags under my eyes are actually getting better. I've been using CeraVe as an under eye cream. And my dermatologist said that I will see progress after six to eight uh, weeks of continued use. It has only been two. So, um, it's not there. But, uh, it's getting there. You know, and I haven't put the, um, moisturizer on. I'm not going to do it in front of you, though. I just have to remember to do it afterwards. So, I was sent a snag nabbit. Here, let me, there we are. This is what I was looking for. Um, it comes in a plastic, and you take it out of the plastic. Now, I don't know if you can see this, but the top is grooved, the bottom is smooth and sharp. And what you do is, here, put this over here, private stuff. Um, go to some place on here where the thread is loose. All right? There's some place on here that the thread is loose. You've been, um, You've been working on it, and there's a loose thread or uh, some back thread pulled up to the front uh, front of the, uh, the um, thing. So we'll pretend this one is what I need, um, is a loose thread. So what you do is, yeah, let's get you to see that. It's right here. You put it in the corner. Yeah, the corner, I don't know if you can see it, but it's right here, of the stitch. Then you press it on through. And that means that what was loose becomes tightened. And the thread from the back is moved back to the bag. Back. Here, plastic, plastic, plastic. Oh, come on now. Look at me. Oh, there it is. Put it back in the plastic because it's really important. So when you do that, you what you're doing is you're putting the um, the sharp edge to the hole. So you're pulling the sharp edge through the hole. And then the this um, other edge that is um, um, rough, uh, and you pull that 
through the fabric. So it's the rough edge that cuts the thread and brings it through. But you start off with doing the sharp edge so that you can actually pull it through your fabric. Because what you've got other threads on there. So take a drink. My throat, very sore. Uh, let you go, uh, know what I have been going on since it's been since July. Uh, right now, I'm alone in my bedroom. My sister has gone to group, which I graduated from two weeks ago. And um, I'm only aftercare. And, excuse me. Ooh. Okay, um, so I only go like once every other week. I got two. I got two weeks to, to um, break, and then beginning on next Monday, which is Christmas Eve, I'll go that Monday, and then either the next week or the week after, I go again, and then like that. Um. I have been doing good at church. I've been going to church. And I'm getting freer and freer at church. You know, I'm not so subdued. I'm not I, I, I'm not so embarrassed. I'm uh, I'm feeling free to praise God in my way, you know, to thank him all the time. You know, I'm feeling free in order to testify and say what the Lord had told me this week, you know, or that week, uh, or the last week, or the week before, you know, that seemed important to me, and that I, he taught me, and it's, I'm not preaching, it's not for me to preach, you know, but um, what I am saying is, oh, look what God said, look what the Bible revealed to me, isn't this wonderful, like the, um, the latest thing he taught, oh, um, showed me was all these verses about worry. You know, he said to be anxious for nothing. And since the Bible is the truth, his word is the truth, he spoke his word, then it's command. And then for me, for my faith, then I should give my worries over to him and he'll take care of it. Now, I remember most of the time. Except when my brain goes cuckoo. You know, the bipolar thing. My blood my blood vessels and my brain cells, they go boop. And uh, then God has to gently remind me Layla, what did I say? And, you know, he reminds me to be anxious for nothing. I says, oh, yeah, sorry. <laughs> uh, so I calm down and, I, you know, I just breathe and I give it over to God and then I just forget about it. But, you know, the brain chemicals, they try to make me forget but God is always there reminding me so I'm happy it's been a long time since I've seen the chiropractor um finances got so tight and uh um I could no longer afford to go see her and just for kicks and giggles, I did some, um, I know I keep saying instant back. I'm sorry. Let me go to the edge of my sheet, my tree, my, um, chair. So, uh, I did some calculations and I did some finances and I, you know, what do I need to save up to go for the chiropractor for a year? A thousand dollars. A thousand dollars. 
I'm like, mm, not this year. No. Maybe on 2020, not two, 2019, because finances, but maybe in 2020, Lydia can grant me that money out of the income tax, and I'll have a year of chiropractor. But, uh, you know, put your shoulders down, Lila. Um... Until then, I'll just deal with the headaches and the, the back aches and try to um, remember what she taught me and, um, you know, do some exercises that uh, help. Um, hold on. finally woke up. And you want to know what time it is? It is 11.30. Oh, God. I need to wash my hair. Because, look at... And you can even see the dandruff in my hair. At least I can. I look back at the last video. White here, white there, white there. And I'm not gray. That's all dandruff. Good Lord. Well. Pause, pause while I think. I decided that I'll do a whip parade. Um, hold, hold on. Oh, sorry. No, what is it you need? Someone needs to sign for this, and I don't, I don't know what to. Um. Are you the client? No, Chris is. Um. Okay. Little Chris needs to sign it. Mom said, and an adult has to sign it. All right. As a minute or two of Thudler. Okay, I'm going to do a whip parade and I'm going to show you the progress of what I have done since last uh, video. Okay, and I don't remember where I was before, but I've worked on all my um my all my whips so the first one is what i'm working on right now queen al hisabeth take her off my q-snap well yeah i'm gonna take her off my q-snap i'm gonna have to put her back on because i'm working on her and i want to finish this page So, I'm cleaning it up, getting all these pesky threads out of the way, because I do parking. And let's see, move the needle minder. There it is. Put it up here. I sincerely hope you can hear this, because I took this off. Okay, I have gotten the top row done, and I have gotten page five done. 
of Queen Elizabeth. Isn't she gorgeous? The row that I'm working on is the second row of page six, I think. Yeah, second row of page six. Um, there's uh, four across, and there'll be five down. So I'm working on the second row. And what I have decided to do is try out that diagonal thing. You know me, I'm always trying to um, figure out, you know, what's the best way to do something. And, and since I haven't uh, tried everything, you know, I still have stuff to do. Um, on this... You know, right here, while working on page five, I had tried the row across thing and parking your threads down the column. So you've got part threads for each column. Yeah, that doesn't work out well. I don't like it. Too many threads. So I am doing column by column but I'm parking the threads down that col col column but when I'm done with the thread for the column I clip it off and uh, if I see it on the next column you know this one if I see it on that next column, I will, um, like up here, I will sew the thread. Oh, come on, Layla. I'll sew the thread um, in this area and then park the thread here. But if I see if that color that I have does not go for the rest of the column, and Lord, my arms hurt, uh, then... Uh, and it's not over here, I will just, uh, you know, cut it off. I don't park it anywhere, and I'll re, um, rebobinate. Because all these threads going across, I couldn't keep up. No, couldn't keep up. What is this? A holly leaf. Man, that was from last year. Now, I'm going to talk to you for a minute while I put this back on the column on my Q-snap. And uh, if you have any questions about that, put them in the question box. You know, I always like to answer. You know means that somebody has watched my video and they feel comfortable enough to ask me a question. Like Ginger, Gerald and uh, Coffee Stitcher. You don't know how lonely it is, you know, when you put up content and practically nobody um, talks to you. It's like, okay, am I that very wrong? I mean... What have I done? What don't I do? Because I know I have fans out there. You talk to me sometimes. <sighs> I got a stray hair. Um, pardon? Light, light in the face. There. All right, light off. So, um, you know, you talk to me on Stitch Mania, you talk to me on uh, Cross Stitch Finish Line, you talk to me on Heaven and Earth, you know, so I know I've got some fans, but I think I'm one of those people that you will, are filler for you, that you want to watch, and you're part of a list of people 
that I'm part of the list that people watch. I'm just not that, I won't say important. Um, I'm just not that person that you stop the list and type in a question, you know, or a comment or something like that. So, um, I'm glad that people watch me. I'm glad to be the filler. So, uh, no worries. I just would love it if somebody would talk to me. Why do I do this? What do I do? One, two, three. Crap. That was from my other one. Where did this one go? Great. I'm missing two sti uh, two uh. I'm missing two Q snaps because I have another one, like I said before, and this is number two. This is or it should be number one because this is my main project. Number two is over there, and I got a gift certificate. Look what I got. Another cute snap. Because guess what? You can't have enough. Oh, and my medicine is kicking in. Okay. So, behind me is a whole stack of my whips. Oh, and I think I've, well, uh, I've worked on all of them since July. At one point or another. So, here's the main one. G.I. Patrinos. The Last Supper. And I am working on, what page am I working on? 15. There was uh, 12 across, or was there 13? Now I'm going to have to walk, look at it. You know? Oh, great. How many across was there? Because I've got the copied. There's going to be 52 pages, so this is important. Um, here are my working copies. Because I was smart enough to make working copies. Yeah, 13 across. So I'm working on page 15, which means this is the second page um, page of the second row. And I say that because this one I have to do the diagonal on. So far, all of my um, projects have been set up to do the uh, diagonal. You know, two pages. Um, on the row, and uh, uh, so I'll start on the the other the the row before it, one page. So I've got one two pages, and then I'm going under one page. So then I'll do three, two, one, four, three, two. You know what I mean. And don't mind me. Yeah, I have worked on this uh, more than the last time I showed you. So, here 
He is. There's no way you'll get that in one whole thing. Well, maybe if I do this all the way down. Yeah, I'm leaning far back. Way far back. And this is all crumpled. So here it is. Way far back. Benefits of getting a chair that does not... Uh, it's broken already. Okay. So, last time you saw it, I was working on page 14. Which is this page right here. So, I'm going to fold this up. Now, I did this for the 100 Days of Hate uh, challenge. <laughs> I failed. I only could make it to 52, and then I'm like, no. So, as you can see, I finished, there, I finished the first apostle. And I'm working on the second one. Now, the reason why I decided to do two, one, and all this is because this row right here, this row right here is white tablecloth. I am not doing 13 pages of white tablecloth all by myself, all alone. Not all in a row I won't. So, I'll do page two, and then I'll do uh, page uh, 13, 13 is 26. I'll do page 27. Finish page two, do page 27. Yeah, right there. Because all that tablecloth, <laughs> I can do a page at a time, but I am not doing it all in a row. Wait. Let me get this folded correctly. Okay, put it back in its tote. I really love this tote. It was a gift. It's my favorite. And I've got others. And I love them. Don't don't doubt I don't love them. But I love this tote. Love it. Okay. Now, here is when we see if the pause actually works. Okay? Because my medicine kicked in and I gotta go. Okay. Um, that should have worked. Um, because the pa uh, timer paused and now it's going again. Uh, um, 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 um. I was doing pretty well until I had my medicine, you know, said, go away. And unfortunately, I had to. I had to listen to it. That's what medicine is for. Okay, this is ink circles. What the heck? Oh. Oh. <laughs> what I did. I was looking at this and there's these threads right here. I'm like, what the heck? Why do I have threads on the back of my thing? Is it loose uh, Is it loose threads? I mean, what is it? <laughs> and then I remembered. I, um, marked the top. <laughs> I had to put an X to mark the top. <coughs> So, 
Here it is in green color, color way, col green color way, spring tapestry, stitchy box, ink circles number one, which also was a gift. So here it is. Not the one I'm doing. Because this is supposed to be green. But it doesn't look green. It looks more like rose. And I've got the blue. Why would anyone call this the green colorway? The rose one. An orange. That's not what they call it. They call it green. Oh, maybe it's because of the um the linen. They included uh, um pale green linen. And mine's on blue linen. So everything was everything was involved in uh, came in the kit. Okay. Now this isn't iron or anything. And yes, my edges are starting to fray. I'll have to figure out what to do about that next time. But here it is. One half complete. I'm so proud of it. I think, no, it wasn't the one. I don't remember what it, which one I, it was that um, I was working on when uh, Chris got kicked out of the house. Although it wasn't so dramatic as being kicked out, like, go, take your stuff and go. You know, he went to inpatient because he was talking about killing himself because we felt Lydia found out what he was doing. And uh, Lydia said, nope, you're going inpatient because he's not going to, you know, that's, that's a cop out. You do something that bad and you're going to say, let me kill myself so I can get away with the consequences. Uh -oh. He crossed the line. And if you are in one of my groups that I go to on cross stitch, that I uh, you know what happened. Uh, I'm not going to mention anything else besides that. Probably be against the law anyway. So he's a new girl. Picked him up right out of the impatient. Ah, now I found. Um, where the other two Q-snaps went. Ooh, that bottom of the, um, T, ooh. And as you can see, I'm scratching, scratching myself all over, mostly right here. I have gotten a rash. Flea bites, mosquito bites, I don't know what they are. Look, just look, all up there. And this is just one arm. The back. Two, but not as bad. But you can see all the way up here. You know? And then my other arm. It's like, I don't even know if you can see this. But the... <laughs> I gotta tell you that the um, the bumps themselves, the bites themselves, have started to go away. But what that is is me scratching it, so, scratching it and scratching it and scratching it and scratching it like this. And I've opened up sores and ho holes. And this one's new. Holes and all, and I've got it, you know, down here, down here, down here, up there. I won't show you, you know, because you can't see and who wants to be flashed. 
Uh, but it's bad. So this is what happened to my other two uh, kiss snaps. I forgot I didn't take them all off. This is Sweet Bears. Previously, I had, oh, okay, I can't, um, previously, oh, uh, previously I had done the bear in the middle and the purple cupcake. Um, since then, I've done the green cupcake and I started on this cupcake. That one over here. So, uh, not much done, but some progress. This is supposed to be my at home project. The only thing is, I'm madly working on Queen Elizabeth and I haven't want, been wanting to uh, put her down. And again, I go away. I'm sorry, but this chair is broken. I cannot lift it up anymore. Uh, I'm sorry. I apologize. You probably don't want to, you know, click off of me because of all the problems. Crap. Okay, I don't know where that one went. I'm supposed to have, uh, you see how under here I have these felt, fab fabric felt things? And it's under all this one, this one, and this one. But for some reason, I lost this one. You know? This is upside down. <laughs> Funny, right? Okay. Back to its position on the bed. Oh, and that was a gift too. A Disney original tote bag. Woohoo! Woohoo! I love it. I really do. I really, really love it. That was my first tote bag that I used. I also got a very badly Bradley um shopping bag that I haven't used yet. But look at that. Isn't it gorgeous? Handle. Whoops. Oh, and look. Danielle sent this to me. He's always feeling bad. Look what she said. She sent me 